All right. Um, I've been working on my bridge for quite a while, so I was thinking of changing it up a little bit, at least for right now. Um, there's a little project I wanted to work on sort of in the uh, little area I've got out back here. Um, from a recommendation, let's see, it looks like a missing block there. Let me knock this one out here and replace it. But uh, based on a, off a recommendation by uh, Firefox 123455, um, I'm not really sure uh, exactly what you were. Oh my gosh. <laughs> narrow escape um not exactly sure what what you were recommending me to do but i think it was something along the lines of uh, building a pathway out from here and then sort of uh descending the mountain uh making that path descend the mountain i mean so um yeah i think i'm gonna work on that for now and uh i think what i'm gonna do is try to keep this leftmost block and this rightmost block keep water flowing down those and then not in the middle if that's even possible I'm, I'm not really sure um, <clears throat> well, I'm sure it's possible but just for me I mean <laughs> so uh, I'm going to get some glass if I've got any mm, doesn't look like it I'm just going to grab some sand then I guess and cook some up okay that should be enough glass for right now and uh yeah maybe i'll go ahead and build some stairs too actually okay so i'm just gonna put a couple blocks right here and just see what this does really <laughs> hmm maybe i'll have to just build into the water. I guess I'll go ahead and extend this out a little bit where I wanted it to end up going. And then um, see if this fixes it. Ah. Dang it. It's weird how it will... I don't know, you can sort of shape it, but it's like you have to carve it out. <laughs> I don't know, it's very bizarre. Like, what the heck is that doing? Um, Alright, well, maybe I'll, I'll just extend this top part a little bit further. <clears throat> this is why I like to cut stuff out a lot, just because this is me fumbling around and doing nothing useful. <laughs> I have to fill this all in again. <laughs> Go away. Dang, this stuff really is on my nerves. Right, let's see what happens when I knock all this out now. Okay, that's pretty decent. So at least it does fall straight down once it's all said and done. So if I knock this out, will it spill back in? No? Okay, cool. What about this one? Good. I wish it would just do that. <laughs> oh well. So, I don't know, that's kind of neat actually. If I had water, or if I just had like a bit of a glass roof going, going over this whole pathway heading down, it might be kind of neat. But I don't know. See, I don't have a shovel, do I? Dang. All right, let me go make one. Um, what I want to do with this is I probably don't want to have the glass just hanging, um, floating in midair. I mean, so I'll probably be wanting to put kind of pillars beside it just uh, for realism's sake, you know, for support. So I'm just going to be trying to figure out a way to do that, I guess. And this again. Brilliant. Okay, um, I'm just going to dig out a little bit more here just so I have more room. <laughs> Alright, finally. Man, it took me forever. Um, <laughs> this water from over here kept flowing in here just because this tree I didn't realize was sitting here and 
making everything flow in. So, um, I think this is a way that I am probably going to have to do things just sort of cutting out little bits and pieces here and there just so I can have enough time to think because it's really hard for me um, to truly comprehend what's going on and have a good plan and I don't know figure things out while I'm commentating um, so sorry about that I wish I was actually better at doing two things at one time but yeah, it's not the case so but I, I, as per usual you know I'll try to leave in anything that I, that I think is interesting because like I have mentioned before I do record the entire time so um, yeah anyway I'm gonna just uh, looks like it's getting evening time let me go rest so I don't have to worry about well worry about as many mobs as I would have otherwise Okay, so I've just built this little <laughs> staircase that you can hardly see um, down going this way. And so I'm going to continue this little glass thing above here in the same kind of way. And uh, I'm not sure if I'll put little pillars right here or not because that would block the water coming down. But <clears throat> I think think I'll be okay with that just because it's going to be a, alongside the the rest of it I guess um hopefully anyway I'm not sure how far well we'll see I think <laughs> I always get that number wrong but uh, water travels like seven blocks or eight blocks or something on a flat surface if you just set it down you know it'll travel in uh you know one direction or seven or eight blocks or whatever um so i'm hoping that it when it lands up here it will have it should have enough to come around here and then continue down because then this is going to stair step down like the ceiling or the glass ceiling is just like the floor here so hopefully that once it does that it will allow it to continue in theory so all right so using this same sort of carving out the water with building up blocks and tearing them down um it seems to be working so i'm just going to continue in this same kind of trend here on down this way um so yeah i'll just be doing that you know i'm sure you guys have been screaming at your computer screens this entire time but i just thought of um maybe i could remove the source block of water so i wouldn't have to deal with all this crap <laughs> so i could just build in peace Oh my. Yep, yep, yep. That uh that would be a lot easier, wouldn't it? Well, at least, you know, I didn't have to wait. I, at least I figured that one out all by myself. A little bit belated, but Still did it nonetheless. <laughs> okay, so I'm sort of um, down the mountain a little bit. You can see where I've built the stairs kind of coming down here. I think I'm going to have it turn this way uh, just for just briefly, maybe like turn this way. And then once it gets out, just a, a little bit, turn back this way and head around that way is kind of a switch back. Um, so I think I'm going to place a little post right where I'm standing though. It's kind of a support beam, so I'm going to do that out of logs because I think that will fit the theme of the way that it's looking currently. So, Is that right? Or okay, yeah. Alright, so, so we'll just continue yeah, over this little platform right here. Okay. I think that's the idea. Oh, wait, no, I need to build this up further. Well, anyway, I'll go get some sleep and come back and work on it. It's going to be kind of fun working this way just because I'll get to see the water kind of spill down this whole thing, and hopefully it will work properly, but probably won't all right so uh let's see i think i'm probably going to need to knock out some of these blocks right here actually or else the water is probably going to spill over onto the stairs 
And we don't want that. And uh, I was actually also thinking about digging out this wall, this block. Let's see, from here to here to here to here, and then over one, getting rid of this tree, um, just so the water can flow around everything a little bit more nicely. So, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Yeah, that's sort of what I had in mind right there. Just um, having this a little bit more clear. And then I'm going to place, well, actually, let me get rid of this block here. I'm going to place logs in this corner right here and have this go up um, just for visual standpoint and, you know, support and all that type of stuff. So I think I'm going to do probably the same thing for this block right here or have this one go straight up I guess because um, I don't know I kind of would like dang I'm trapped <laughs> uh, let's see there we go it seems like I would like to have pillars right here and right here but if I had one right there, then I'd have one right there as well. So these two would be like right beside each other, which I'm, I'm just not sure about that. So, um, but I don't know. I, I'm, I think I'm, I think I'm coming around to it. So I'm just going to go ahead and throw these in. I don't like to waste these logs though, uh, cause they, you know, since they produce four stacks of lumber, they're uh, kind of valuable. So, but in pursuit of a sweet base, I'm all for it. So, I just, <laughs> I guess that looks all right. If not, I can always take it back out. That's the good part, I guess. Yeah, I think that's pretty neat, actually. Hmm. I dig it. All right, it's time to throw down a bucket of water here and see what this thing does. I think I think I only had one block. It looked like from what I had, it was just right there. I'm pretty sure, but we'll try it and see what happens. Nope, guess not. <laughs> All right, so is this going to work? Dang, what did I do before? Maybe I need to... Fill these in actually before I do that, and see what see what that does. Because I think I heard from someone a long time ago that the water will, once it lands on a surface, it will look towards the closest thing that it can fall off of. So if I were to block everything that it could fall off onto, then I, I'm assuming it would just spread out evenly. So that that's kind of what I'm going for. Um, so hopefully that will work. I can't remember if I may have just filled this whole thing in anyway, but like with, if I were to just click everywhere for source blocks, I cannot remember what I did though. So I'm going to figure this out and then I'll be back to you. <laughs> it's a little bit better. Yeah. Just covering this little section up right here. Just, uh, it, uh, definitely works as advertised. So. That's cool. I'm trying to see if this would extend anymore. I'm, it looks kind of weird that it stopped right there. I'm not sure why. It might be because of these edges over here being open. So, because um, obviously I do want this to extend further here to where it can roll down this and fall off either side. So, maybe I'll just close these blocks off like that. Mm -hmm. And uh, maybe I'll close that one off too. Let's see what happens. Okay, so let's stop there. Let me try it again. Or maybe I'll stick one there actually. Okay, it did go a little further. Okay, yeah, it does actually go further if you place these blocks here. So, um,. I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to create another little spout right here into the, the land and um, or just make this one wider or something like that. So 
That's what I'm going to do. In theory, it should go everywhere. Cool. Alright, so this is flowing on both sides. Yeah, looks like it. So now I can knock all these out. Okay, that corner block there is a log, so I'll leave that. Sorry if you can't see anything, I can't really see much either. Okay, and then I'll knock these out again too. Cool. Alright, that's the idea. It's got that whole thing filled out, and it looks like it should be running down the entire length. Yep. Alright, let's give it a look from in here. It's pretty neat, I think. I guess I haven't continued that out, but I'm uh, not sure how long I'll want to continue this sort of waterfall thing, if it'll even work uh, going around a corner here. I assume it might, but um, I don't know. It's a pretty cool theme. Plus, I'm pretty sure... Well, no, I'm not sure, actually, uh, if it would protect me from enemies or not. Seems like they might be able, if they were stuck in this water, it seems like they could still probably climb through, but whatever. It dicks coo. So, this episode's been going on a while, but uh, since I'll be cutting out some, I'm not sure how long that's going to end up being. So, but anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.